Hope everybody having a good day out there on this Flight Sports TV. I already know what it is. Like I said, I hope everybody having a good Saturday. Uh, make sure you hit that uh, bell on the icon because you never know when we about to go up. It's Flight Sports TV. You already know what it is. Uh, we moving and grooving. Uh, still giving you giving the, giving the shit to the people. You understand? Pause. Uh, what I want to talk about today is I want to tell you why Lonzo Ball has always been better than Ben Simmons. You understand? It's just they just had a flip of the coin and different circumstances and we're going to get into everything. I'm going to break it all down. Uh, we're going to talk about it. You know, also get some feedback later on. Uh, let me know your thoughts on this. Uh, shout out Kid Max. Uh, you already know what it is. The shit feeling like how it used to be. You, know, you feel me? When I see Max in the chat, it let, it, it let me know. It let me know what's up. <laughs> when I see Kid Max comment, I know, I know, I know we back to the essence. You understand? Shout out T. Sam. You, you know what I'm talking about? Shout out SMG, shout out Dave, shout out Rave, shout out everybody, shout out All Access, shout out all the, all the guys, man, uh, you know, uh, A1. Uh, let's get straight into it, man. Um, I want to tell you right now that, like I said this, Lonzo Ball is, has always been better than Ben Simmons, and, and it wasn't even more evident than it was this season that just passed. It, it was so much evident that... Lonzo Ball is better and has always been. The problem is you had an organization who put up with certain things that Lonzo Ball never had the luxury of, of, of them allowing him to do. They never gave Lonzo Ball the opportunity to spread his wings and run the offense the way he wanted to. You understand? They always had some type of issues with Lonzo Ball and the way he was doing doing business out in New Orleans. You know, any even in L.A. as well. Pardon me. In L.A., first year, jerking him in and out the fucking lineup. You see Luke Walton. I mean, he, he took no prisoners, you know. Um, and then Lonzo came in the league with a lot of politics, and I think some of the politics kind of led into the bullshit, you know, where these coaches and these people in the executive positions was fu were systematically fucking him over. What I want to tell you this about Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons couldn't shoot. From the moment he stepped foot in the league, they knew he couldn't shoot. Ben Simmons has never improved nothing about his game. You understand? This, I look at Giannis, for, for instance. I want to talk about these guys who people say just can't shoot. You look at Giannis. You look at Ben. I, just, those two are evident. I think, like I said, Lonzo has completely left that equation last season, which I think it was just a shooting for him than it was. It was him adjusting, shooting from that left side, coming from college and then transitioning that shot into the league, I think that was where the fucked up part happened. And I don't think Lonzo, it was a situation that Lonzo couldn't shoot. It was just a, just, it's, it's a different game, you understand? And like I said, it's already you, you you got an unorthodox shot and you coming into a serious league, you understand? So everything came at one time, pause, you understand? So, when Lonzo would miss two or three shots, maybe, his, maybe one or two, he's out, you understand? You know, ben Simmons could do whatever the fuck he wanted to do. Ben Simmons had free range to do anything and everything, to try anything, do whatever. Ben Simmons never got worked on his jump shot. Mind you, Ben Simmons is on a max contract, ladies and gentlemen. These, I want to let you know right now that Ben Simmons is stealing money. You understand? You don't understand. These people are not... You, they don't work at McDonald's. You know, these dudes, motherfuckers, is making big time bread. Ben Simmons is on a hundred plus million dollar max extension. You understand? Are you telling me you can't take your ass in the gym and, and learn how to shoot? You understand? I mean, this is crazy. You know, I don't understand how Philadelphia put up with that shit because Lonzo never had that opportunity. What I what I see what what people might look at uh, Ben Simmons. Oh. He's, uh, his assists are up more. His rebounds are up a slight bit more. I think all of that uh, is uh, is basically constituted in to Ben Simmons having the basketball way more than Lonzo has it. The basketball has power. We all know this. I believe all of us are ball players. We either watch it or played it in um, in our past, or or some of us are still playing to this day. You understand? It, it is elementary. You understand, if Lonzo Ball had the basketball, the ball got power. If Lonzo would have had the ball, I believe more assists would have went up. The, right then and there, Lonzo, Ben Simmons never dealt with the situation Lonzo did, but he should have. There was no quality backup out in Philadelphia. Who the fuck was backing up Ben Simmons? I'll wait.
You understand? They was letting Ben do whatever. It didn't, all hell didn't break loose. And it's, and it's kind of messed up for Ben Simmons to take this approach because, because you hear all the news coming out right now with Ben, how he trying to hold out. He might not fuck around and come to camp. He ain't going to do this. He ain't going to do that. What I want to tell people is this about Ben Simmons. They had your back. You understand? Embiid always went to bat for him. Um, and that Doc Rivers was going to bat for him all playoff season. They got eliminated. Uh, you understand? And and they really got eliminated because of his dumb ass. Uh, he, you pass up a lap. You 6'8". See, I'm starting to think, is Ben Simmons really trash or did he just completely quit on the Philadelphia 76ers? Because it, 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 that's tricky to me. You got a layup. Listen. We we we've been playing basketball for since we were kids. You know what I'm saying? I said, like I said, the lay, a layup. This is what I tell my son: a layup is the easiest shot in basketball. You understand? You need you need you need to be making this fucking layup. You, know you ain't gonna tell me Ben Simmons don't know how to make a layup. You understand? He quit on the Philadelphia 76ers, and then for that guy. And like I said, Lonzo has never quit on his teams. He got put in situations he might not have liked. Did, do you think Ben Simmons liked that? Maybe he was being played at the four sometimes or a different matchup. I doubt it. But Lonzo, but he, you know, and, and maybe that uh, had, fucking contributed to him tripping the fuck out. But Lonzo Ball been misplaced ever since he got in the fucking league. And all he did was put his head down, pause, and keep rolling. You understand? And keep, keep working. You know, um, these guys now, Ben Simmons should be ashamed of himself. As shitty as he played this last playoffs, cost him. And this dude, Joel Embiid, had a torn meniscus and was giving dudes 40. You understand? Embiid, he could have blew his fucking knee out fucking with Ben Simmons. You understand? He's dangerous. You understand? For a guy who won't improve nothing, you know? Lonzo Ball has improved every single year of, of his career. It wasn't not one year that Lonzo didn't improve every aspect of his game. You see now he the free throw shot is as up. The three point the three point shot is up. You understand? You can see his confidence. Everything about Lonzo is different from the moment he stepped foot in the league. Can the same be said for Ben Simmons? I rest my case. So now I don't know if Ben Simmons needs another destination. Is that going to fix everything? I don't know. You understand? But all I know is you take you with you no matter where you go. You understand? So if he don't take his ass and work on the goddamn three-point free throws, just shooting the basketball. You understand? Is he going to be in the same situation in any offense he's in? Because is Giannis has proven it, even though that they broke through this season. But what I will give Giannis is he will take the shot. Giannis will shoot a three, and he might miss it, but he you can see he shot that motherfucker with confidence. You understand? And you can live with that. You understand? You can't live with the shit Ben was doing. Lonzo would never do that. Lonzo might have missed some shots, but he always was ready to take them. Sometimes he did get a little reluctant here and there and there. But as you've seen him progressing, like I said, five years, four years, he he's not reluctant to shoot shit. You understand? He he gonna let that bitch go. He might miss two, three. I think Gentry put him onto that. What I will give Lonzo is he did have uh, possibly, like I said, you had a guy willing to work with you, but you ain't gonna tell me that you don't have people in Philadelphia willing to work with Ben Simmons. You understand? You ain't gonna tell me that. You know, I just think this is pure laziness and is and is robbery. What's going on right now with Ben? You know, um, but it is what it is. And for him to damn near try to force his way out, I mean, seriously, you know, it, it, it's ridiculous. It's a, it's a fucked up situation. Um, Lonzo Ball has never wreaked havoc in the organization like Ben Simmons is doing right now. You know, just take basketball skills aside. We know that Ben Simmons has not improved his game every single year he's been in the league. But Lonzo has. I want to tell y'all a stat line. I didn't even talk about stats yet. I, I just was talking really just I, I was talking really just talking about the eye test. Cause you really don't you can you could have you could be Stevie Wonder out here and see that Lonzo Ball has improved way more than Ben Simmons have um in in they in their ten years in the league. You understand? Lonzo and Ben both averaged fourteen points per game this season, ladies and gentlemen. Fourteen. They both did. Ben Simmons is on a max contract. Lonzo got four years eighty five million. I think something is wrong with that. I think ben, we, Lonzo need to get that Ben Simmons money. And I and I and tell me otherwise if he if he don't. So for Ben Simmons, even his ranking, Ben Simmons ain't as good as uh, you know. I, I'm just saying, I'm not saying he trash. 
but he ain't where he ranked at. Like how the how ESPN and Sport, they overranking Ben Simmons. It's a lot of players better than Ben Simmons, and it has been for a long time. He ain't no LeBron James. I don't want to hear that bullshit. Oh, yo, put him on the team. He could be LeBron. No, he's not LeBron. So it is what it is. It's Flight Sports TV. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts. But I'm just stating facts. Lonzo Ball has always been better than Ben Simmons. And we're going to leave it at that. I need everybody to hit that like button and most definitely hit that subscribe button. Y'all already know it's Flight Sports TV. Hit that bell on the icon so you're notified when we're going up. Because it could be at any fucking second. It's Flight Sports. We're getting up out of here. Y'all know what it is.